This is the greatest Mr. Beast title pack in the world. Maybe. I don't know. I like it though, and hopefully you guys will too. You will need to be on DaVinci Resolve 17.4 to use this. It's free to download and the link is down in the description below. Now I say it's free, please do consider donating anything you can to make sure that I can keep making these awesome DaVinci Resolve resources. Now the font I used is called Comica Axis. It's the closest I can find to the actual Mr. Beast font. It's completely free to download, but I cannot include it within the package itself. You'll have to go and source it on your own, but it's dead easy. Comica Axis, pop that into Google and you'll find it in absolutely no time at all. Of course, that's just the one I've used, the one that replicates Mr. Beast. If you don't want to use that, you're free to choose any font that you like. So how do you install it? Well, first of all, I recommend that you just close DaVinci Resolve. Close all of DaVinci Resolve down and then download the file from the link. You'll end up with a DRFX file like this. Don't worry, it's got a funky file name. That's normal. You can just ignore that. With DaVinci Resolve closed, just double click on this DRFX file and DaVinci Resolve will open up. And when it does, it'll ask you if you want to install this Mr. Beast template bundle. Click on install and then open a project as normal. Then once you're on the edit page, like I am here, open up the effects library, come on down to titles, Mr. Alex Tech, and within there you'll see a Mr. Beast title and it will say Beast. Just grab that and put it over your footage like so. Now the easiest way to do this, lengthen it over the entire section that you wish to do the titling. So I'm going to put it all the way across here like so. Then give the title a click, open up the inspector, top right hand corner, go to video, title, and then you've got all of your options within here. Now quick tip, if you've dropped the Mr. Beast tile on your timeline but the text isn't appearing here like so, it's simply because you haven't got this Comica Axis font. If you want it, go and download it, if not, just change the font to something else and then it will appear as normal. So first things first, you've got your text box at the top so you can change what this is going to say. We're going to come back to that in a minute. Then we've got our font, so we can change this to whatever we want it to be. And we've got things like color, center, size, angle, tracking, and line tracking. And then under there, we've got pump amount and pump speed. So at the beginning, the main effect is this little pump animation. If you want it to be a much greater animation, bigger, you can just increase this pump amount. And if we hit play, it's much, much bigger like so. The pump speed works kind of in the wrong way, but if you increase this number, it actually slows it down. So if you want a slower animation, you can just increase that number like so. We've then got things like border thickness, so it's got a black border on it. You can change the color if you want to. Underneath there, finally, we've got animation. If you give that a click, for those that really like to mess with it, this is the animation curve that we're using to get this pump effect. If you want to customize it, make it even greater, make it do some weird stuff, just change that, add some keyframes, and you can change the animation as you wish. So you want to do all of that first. Drop it on your timeline, make it the length of the entire portion you want to work with, open up the inspector, change the color, change the font, change the line spacing, the pump animation, get it looking exactly as you want it. Then once you've done that, we can cut it up to line it up to our words. So this section here is, this is the greatest Mr. Beast title pack in the world. Now I'm gonna use my waveforms to help me and just gonna play through really quickly. So I start here, so I'm gonna cut that in. The first word is this, and then right here, this looks like the is. So I'm gonna give my Mr. Beast title a click, use Control and B on my keyboard to do a cut. That's the is, so we'll cut there. That's gonna be the, what's this one? That's greatest goes to there. So now if we hit play on that, you can see we have the pulsing, which is exactly what we want. So then you just need to go and change the words. And again, it's really simple. This first one is just going to be this. And then my second one is is. Third one is the. You get the idea. Oh, let's come back when I've finished it. So we've changed all of those titles, so now if we hit play. Perfect. Now of course you can go into any individual section and edit it as you want to. So I'm going to change the beast to be, let's go with a red. So we're just going to select this, we'll go with red. And we're going to make that much larger because that's the main point of it, Mr. Beast. And then the world we're going to make green. And we're going to do the same thing, we're going to increase the size. And what we'll also do is give it a slightly bigger pump 
and slow that down so it's nice and obvious. And now if we hit play. Easy as that. Now don't forget to subscribe to the channel because I will be making another video where I show you exactly how I made this title pack. Plus there'll be more free resources in the future. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I'll catch you next time.